September 29th. We're here at one of Ryan's farms. Looped in on the back side of this bean field here. All right, guys, we're doing this like a newscast today. We're out here on this beautiful Friday after work, back here at the old secret farm, the sanctuary. It's October 13th. Me and Ryan are back here at the old honey hole. Hey guys, it's October 17th. Sorry if you can't hear me here. Uh, it's cool. What a tornado up here today. Did you hear that light? October 18th, the day after the, uh, the craziness. Three new shooters showed up yesterday. We saw Brady, the buck that came in here originally after the first day. And they just put on a show for us last night. I made it to the stand. While we were climbing up, there was a doe in the field about 100 yards away. We got up there and cleaned. She just fed out there for like 10 minutes and went back into the woods. I had my fence open on my pants. I don't know what you call them. I call them bitchin' burgers because that's all I'm gonna be doing the rest of the night is bitching about them. But they all fell down into my pants. So I'm just getting pricked all night long. He's dead. Oh, he smoked. <sighs> Call me <Amber> real quick. <laughs> That's her. <ridiculous. laughs> Hello. Hey, what up? Hi. Oh, shot a buck. <laughs> what was it? It's a big one. Is it? Bigger than last year's. Is it the one that's been coming out? No, uh uh. No. I don't think. Is it dead? It ran on the neighbors, but I'm 90% sure he's dead. Nice. Yep. Hey, you got a yeah, Johnny got it. Send it to me. Uh, and I will. All right, guys. Uh, Nate just got here. The deer did run onto the neighbor's property, so before Nate came, he went around and he knocked on the door for us and told us go ahead. So we're just waiting for my dad now. We see the deer. He's about 70 yards in the woods here, so very anxious to go over to him. But Wait, my dad should be here and he's bringing a four wheeler because he's too big to be walking or dragging his deer up there. The meat wagon has arrived. Big Ted finally just got down here at the four wheeler. He's always got the hard job, he says. I said, start hunting. 
So the deer's right in here about 70 yards, so we're gonna take a walk in here and go get our hands on them finally. Oh, here's some more blood. Yeah, it was a frontal shot. I was scared to death of it. Oh, he, he's pouring. Well, guys, here he is. It's November 13th. And I think, I, I think this is the one I've been having on camera. I'm not 100% sure. But I've been holding out for a buck bigger than last year. And uh, when I saw this, I was like, Johnny, is he bigger than last year's? Johnny's like, no doubt. So he uh, came in about 20 yards. He worked a scrape right before us. Johnny couldn't see him. And I was like, how can you not? He's like 20 yards. But Johnny had a tree in front of him. And he was feeding. And he was like facing us. And our wind, I could feel it start switching, hitting my back. So I decided to take the frontal shot, but I just kept it tucked in close to that. He was kind of quarter and two, so I tucked it in close and he only ran 70, 75 yards. So it's a done deal. 2022 20, tag has been punched. 